Wadeka is an artist, an artist who makes music. You may know him from uh, the KSI diss track. You may also know him from his previous like albums like Bad Internet Rapper, Voice Memos, maybe if you listen to him a lot, maybe from me to you. He just released recently his most recent album, I Didn't Mean to Haunt You, which I thought was really good, and I'm definitely gonna do a long review on that. Uh, he had some leftovers from the album. He's dropping those now in like an EP, like little mini EP, like single fashion. He's dropping two songs every two to three weeks for the next five pack and he's doing that over the course of like three months and he's already released two of the pack and today i'm just gonna be reviewing those it's called the scrapyard series and i guess that's fitting because it's like the scrap songs that didn't make i didn't mean to haunt you or maybe some songs that he's doing right now he said each of them were kind of a different style i don't really see that in scrapyard 2 it kind of just sounds the same except for i make it look effortless that's totally different from anything else in scrapyard 2 for scrapyard 1 let's start off there scrapyard 1 when i first listened to the track with Breakins, I really thought that Quadeca's lyrics on that are crazy. He, he's singing good, uh, but it was a little bit jarring the first time I heard it because it was like my first time listening to Quadeca. It was my first time listening to Quadeca in like a few, you know, months. So I don't know. It's just like a little checkup point. Where's he been? You know, he's been doing good. He's still making music, you know. The track's called A La Carte. Pretty good. Not like A La Carte. It's A La Carte. Uh, track two, You Don't Know Me Like That. Pretty, some pretty cool, like, layered, like, pads in the back. Quadek has pitched up vocals and like the refrains in his vocals. It sounds pretty cool, like pretty like experimental for, for the stuff he's been doing so far. Uh, and you know, the track ends off as like this crazy like thing going on. Crazy beat, crazy. <laughs> Yeah, it's just, it's like, the, it's like a carnival arpeggio. You guys just don't get it. It's crazy. It's good. But that's Scrapyard 1. Scrapyard 1, I think, uh, overall, for two tracks, the two tracks are pretty good. It's only two tracks, Scrapyard 1. Scrapyard 2 is, uh, three track, if I can actually say a word without stuttering. Holy crap. Dust Cutter, Under My Skin, and I Make It Look Effortless. Now, Dust Cutter, honestly, it, it's okay. It's okay. It's it's one of the only Quadica songs I think is, like, like worse than, like, a 7 out of 10. The sample, it's pretty pretty good but then you have the guitars in the background it's clashing and then like Quadeca is like getting a little bit too high pitched on the vocals so you can barely hear out of those like that's literally what it sounds like and besides that everything else about the uh, track is good besides that it's pretty good track two under my skin uh pretty good a little bit weird lyric talking about keeping someone under their skin i mean i get it it's probably metaphorical but like this is like uh, man but besides that the track is good at the very end uh that uh the guitar the guitar on this song is crazy it's so clean everything like that it's quadeca knows how to produce a track if there's one thing you'll ever hear me say about quadeca he knows how to produce a track and and track three, this was uploaded to promote Scrapyard 2, so it's a three track single or EP, I don't really know. Uh, I make it look effort, he's talking about making it look effortless. What it is, well, I'm assuming it's soccer or making music. Uh, but, but besides that, here, let me, let me get a little, let me give me a little hint on what this sounds like again. Yeah, it's kind of like, uh, he put, uh, his guitar through that, uh, VST plugin Digitalis and just made it sound like some hyper pop shit. Uh, but besides that, well, that's actually a good thing. But besides that, that's Scrapyard 1 and 2. I'll see you guys when the Scrapyard series is over and I'll do a full review. But I'm just letting you guys know, I like the first two I'm not gonna rate it yet. I'm, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till it's done. Then I'm gonna rate it. <laughs>